morning guys and happy 2023 happy new year man the first vlog of 2023 i don't know if you're gonna be saying this or a like what's on my iphone it'll probably be this video because i'll be excited to edit it i have had this what's on my iphone video for the longest time and i was using it as a just in case i didn't have a vlogmas video i was kind of using it as a just in case because like i always have those videos and like one of my most top performing videos was one of those so anyway um guess where i'm going i'm going to cycle bar it is a beyonce versus bieber ride or i don't know i just love ethan and i like the type of music so i'm going to this one cycle bar winter garden is so much closer it only takes me about like 20 25 minutes to get there which is like amazing unlike fighting the i4 traffic to get to winter park so that's where i'm headed now it feels so good to vlog again and the fact that i completed vlogmas like true vlogmas just makes me so happy i've never actually done true vlogmas before it's always been um you know some videos were like what a, my christmas wish list or some type of tag as like fillers but no i legit picked up the camera like this and vlogged so i'm proud of myself for doing that i wanted a big break from filming which i got because i was kind of burned out on the vlogging the editing just everything like that i was gonna try to get a video up yesterday the what's on my iphone one I was gonna post that one yesterday, but it turns out we got this like huge like packet about the brain and spinal cord And I'm like I want to do that Right now and finish up my medical terminology book I had like one thing to finish up and then a whole like huge packet to do and I wanted to get that done Because I have a really busy weekend. That's why like we're vlogging this weekend because I'm actually doing something um so first is cycle bar obviously and then we're going to get ready and get glam not really not full glam but i might curl the hair though because i like to it's fun yeah just because i want to but we're celebrating my friend's birthday so we're going to this place called bosphorus it's like a turkish cuisine and it's really nice and then we're going to this place called the wine room and you guys have seen the wine room before on my channel so it's gonna be super fun and yeah that's what the plan is today and then tomorrow we're looking for furniture i think for the outside so i don't really know like what all that's gonna entail but you know this is gonna be a fun filled vlog with fun adventures and doing things and I'm actually just listening to Gretchen Garrity's podcast and I love Gretchen Garrity you know me because she's so positive and she just like puts me in a more like positive mindset she's talking about the lucky girl syndrome and honestly I feel like I have that um like in all aspects of my life except for like the love life I have not been so lucky but that's only one little entity and that's something that I really like you can't control the other person but other things like like where my life is going my career my family it's just like i am so lucky and so grateful my friends like everyone i have in my life and stuff it's just i feel like i do have the lucky girl syndrome yeah i'm looking forward to the future and where life takes me and now i'm kind of like going on a tangent and I need to pass this car, so I'm gonna cut the clip here. Okay, so the ride went so well. I got my Starbucks because it's just a thing and I still have like money from the gift card. I always have to justify it because like, I don't know, but I get the cheapest order I can. Like it's just an iced coffee with like almond milk and um, some vanilla. It's the economical route, um, but no, it's like my favorite too because it's not like too sugary and yeah, I don't know. Anyway, gonna run this some errands now. I'm gonna go to the grocery store real quick and um, I have to pick up a prescription for like Sherry's blood thinners. So yeah, let's go. Got the goods, just 
my salad materials and celery because we didn't have any and you guys know I need the celery also too I'm using my reusable bags I think that it's really important so this isn't like a new year's resolution because I've been using reusable bags for a while but I encourage you to make that goal too okay so now I'm going to just get ready and everything is falling it is about 2.17 or 2.18. I have to be at like the restaurant near 5.30. Like that's the time. So um, yeah, just gonna get ready. Did not know what I was going to wear. And typically I always like know what I'm gonna wear to certain things. Like, oh, I have this outfit for this specific thing, but I didn't have that this time. I'll show you guys once. I'm like all ready and everything, but as you can see, I chose to wear this sweater. It's supposed to get kind of like cold. So that's why I'm just like wearing this like light sweater. And then we're all gonna wear like our um, Virgo Capricorn um, astrological sign necklaces, which I think is gonna be kind of fun. Guys, it's just one of those days where like, I think it's cause I'm like nearing my period week, but I am just like not, I just feel like lazy today. I think it's because I went to cycle bar, <laughs> to be honest. I'm just like, oh my gosh, I do not want to do anything. I just want to like sit at home and sleep, but it's okay. I know like once I get to wherever I'm going, it's like, oh, it's fine. But like leading up to that, I'm just like, I don't know. It's like that with like a lot of things. Like I was like that today with cycle bar. I was like, Oh my gosh, why did I sign up for this? I am so tired, but I ended up going and having a really good time. Obviously, great workout, good full body workout. Yeah, it's always like the anticipation to like something. I'm just like, oh my gosh. But then you're feeling good, you're with fun people. It's always like fine, it always ends up being fine. I might do a time lapse of the hair again, I'm not sure. It's just kind of repetitive, like I do the same exact thing. If you want to see like my everyday makeup routine and stuff, I will link it down below. I did one for Vlogmas where like I show everything and then I have all the products linked, which I can link also to in the description box of this video if you want to check it out, but it's kind of repetitive. So that's why I'm like, I'm not going to bore you guys with a another time lapse. Also too, my face is breaking out so bad and I just... I think it's also due to my period coming up, but you know, it's one of those things. So I am going to listen to a YouTube video while I do this. And yes, I'll see you when I'm done. Okay, so this is the final outfit. It took me forever to like get this thing together because like I just didn't know. Normally I always have a plan about what I'm gonna wear to certain things, but this one I didn't. Maybe that's why my mood about this is like, oh my goodness, I don't know, and like sluggish because I didn't know what I was gonna wear. Yeah, I think that's it <laughs> because now I feel good and we're ready. Um, these shoes are honestly falling apart, but I'm wearing them because they just look good and I need something comfortable because I always commit biological suicide that's the wrong meaning of the word. I just like using it when I say, um, I wear like heels because I think it's cute, but then we end up walking like five miles and like my feet are literally dead, get blisters that don't heal after like seven days. So I just like torture myself also to never wear heels to try to make a guy like you because it doesn't work. I've tried. It doesn't work. So, um, <laughs> save your feet the trouble of like looking cute and trying to impress someone because it doesn't work and all you end up doing is hurting yourself and then the rest of the day you're just like why and you just focus on the feet so I'm wearing the flats because we're probably gonna like walk a lot so and then the sweater because it's supposed to get to like 60s in the 60s or maybe 50s or whatever also too I don't know if you guys noticed but back there there's nothing because well frankly let me just take this off because when I do like outfits and stuff like showing you guys I don't want a bunch of stuff like in the background like that's not the goal and since I'm waiting to get um I'm waiting to get my furniture because I don't have the budget right now like it just wouldn't be smart for me to do so I pretty much moved everything over here because I don't have a nightstand either so I'm gonna be like set my stuff here and then plug my phone in and like set it here and everything oh my gosh see I already like threw a shoe like these are not good but 
it's okay. That's another thing. I have like no shoes, but I do have that stuff. It's just boxes. And then this stuff we still have to go over. I mean, go through my parents, but at least like all the clutter and stuff is like not in the view. So it looks a lot cleaner when I do outfit ideas and like trying on things and TikToks and whatever. I don't want like a bunch of stuff in the shot. I also have this angle as well that I can like use. I just need to move the trash can, which is not a big deal. So yeah, overall I love my room. Um, it's just still a work in progress. Also too, I'm carrying this bag because it's cute and I would wear the belt bag because it's like super convenient, but I don't know. I just want to be like casual dressy. I don't know if that makes sense. I'm not really good at casual dressy as you can see and it took me like two hours to like get this as an outfit because it was just like so hard. But yeah, casual dressy is not my thing. I'm like either good dressy dressy or loungewear dressy. Okay, so we made it to Bosphorus. This is where we're eating. Looks pretty cute. Anna got sauteed eggplant. Then what did you get, birthday girl? Lavas, hummus, and baba ganoush. Baba ganoush, that's such a fun <laughs> word. And then I got this um, Pinot Noir and it's so good. The waiter like recommended it and I'm like, she did a really good job. Okay, so Anna got this mushroom, like a chicken thing. Yeah. Chicken saute. Anna got this. <laughs> I'm keeping all that in. And then my friend got the same exact thing, but different sauce. Okay, so it's so good, but we all went to go boxes because, um, I don't know, it's just like so filling like, with the rice and stuff. So I'm just gonna take it home. Um, How was yours? So we're gonna get some Taco Bell now. All right, so got Taco Bell, you know, my usual, just a taco hard shell with the meat. And then I got four of those because they're kind of light, you know? And apparently, like, we're not allowed to eat inside, but I don't understand that because like, I'm a paying customer, you know what I'm saying? So like, I don't get their weird ass moves. I don't know, just me. The next day. Okay, so now we're headed to Ikea. We're gonna do some like furniture shopping. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me on that. This is the fit. I'm gonna also wear my like um, belt bag, but it's just like cute, casual, and you know, good for like errand running. I did like a light makeup look. Like I literally just put on really like light makeup just because why not? It's kind of fun and my face has been breaking out so bad and I don't know what it is. I think I need a new beauty blender. So when we, if we go to the Millennium Mall, like I'm gonna probably hit up Sephora to get a new one because I've had, I just realized it's kind of gross. I've had my beauty blender like for a while, like last October, don't judge guys. But the thing is I rarely wear makeup like during the week, like I never wear makeup. That beauty blender has been used every day, but like, you know, bacteria and stuff. So I'm going to try to get a new beauty blender when I'm out and about today. So Valerie and I are twinning. We are. So. We both have our denim shirts on. Yep. Dark pants. Dark pants. Dark shoes. Dark shoes. Well, I have light Dark. shoes. <laughs> and Sherry's sporting her gray. I know. I'm not going to show you. Oh my goodness. She did not get the memo of the denim. I did not denim. get the memo that there was a denim shirt required with black no. and black, which mm -mm. I could if we had another one, but I don't know where I would find another one because I don't own one. Exactly. So, I don't know. Yeah. Guess well, I'm just left out. You have some black okay. on. We have black. Oh no, I have black on. Yeah, just so black. I don't have black. All right. The ladies and I are headed into Ashley Home Store Furniture. 
So we'll see what we end up getting here. Things sparks our curiosity. It's so nice in here. They have so much furniture here, guys. It's crazy. All right, we found a chair that looks and feels pretty good. We don't know if we are gonna go with it, but it's this one. Very sleek, simple, comfortable. Okay, so that was super successful. We ended up going with those black chairs that I just showed you guys. So yeah, they're gonna get delivered pretty soon and we're gonna have like better chairs because our older chairs are kind of like falling apart because they're super old. So yeah, it was very successful. Next up, we are here at Rooms To Go to look for outdoor furniture for our little patio. This furniture store is also like so big. But right now we're heading to the patio furniture area just because this is what we're looking for, obviously. So we found one that we kind of like. It has this like cool gray here. Different fabric choices there. We also like this one. It's just chairs, it's a problem. I think we've landed on a little something, something. Okay, so we ended up getting the one that you just saw with like the blue. We didn't get it. Well, we didn't get it, but we're almost about to get it. <laughs> the reason why we're not getting it yet is because we have to go home and measure. Yes. Okay, so now we're in Ikea and we're looking for like a little place for our stop and drop. So we can put like stuff that we keep downstairs somewhere like near one little location. Uh, guys, this might be an unpopular opinion, but... I do not like Ikea. It takes forever to walk through this place. And even though it's like cute to like see the furniture and stuff, I'm over here like, I don't know. It just takes forever. So, I don't know, is that just me? So we're in the lighting section, so I have to always say Kwa's little saying, ooh, this lighting though. And lastly, I think we're going to be eating at Cheesecake Factory. Hopefully they don't have a super, super long wait. Keeping our fingers crossed. <laughs> Sherry says. All right, so we got our bread. Yeah, you can have the rest. Sherry's having that whole thing over there. And then I'll have this, but we got our bread. So I got my pasta dish and Sherry got chicken. Isn't that like a chicken and pasta thing? It's chicken piccata, so yeah. sauce on Everything looks oh, good. It's perfect, thank you. And then Valerie got her filet with green beans and um, some potatoes over there. It looks really good. Sherry, show us your s'mores cheesecake. Look at that, so crazy.